हाय सर जैसा कि अभी अनिल जी ने कहा कि यू आर द ओनली वन जिन्होंने साउथ इंडस्ट्री को पैन इंडिया के लिए इंट्रोड्यूस किया उनको व्हाट वॉज योर फर्स्ट थॉट व्हेन यू इंट्रोड्यूस बाहुबली टू अनिल जी सो आई जस्ट हैव टू टॉक अ फ्यू इयर्स बिफोर बाहुबली लाइक आफ्टर माय फर्स्ट फिल्म वॉज डन इट वॉज रोहन सिपी यू सेंट मी ऑडिशन टेप एंड सेट वुड यू लाइक टू प्ले जो कि इन अ फिल्म कॉल्ड दम आर दम and that's the first time i came to bombay uh, i realized there's so many filmmakers but don't know what's happening in different parts of the country every time i went to hyderabad no one knew what happened in hindi every time i came to bombay no one knew what happened there but i thought there was like cinema never had a bound i grew up in chennai i grew up learning tamil first then i learned telugu then moved to hyderabad learned a bit of different languages when i was watching films it didn't matter if it was a tamil film or a hindi film at that point and i was like why doesn't the country experience the same and i started doing a little bit of work here and uh, i think it needed that one film and bahubali was that answer and then everybody realized what india as a as a single cinematic nation so i feel like lot more will happen from now on hello prashant prashant well uh, I have to say first uh, I think post that era we all every single filmmaker in Telugu is ambitious they want to make sure the story is heard the fact that if you it doesn't matter where you are in the country if you tell a story there's a whole world out there that will receive you and I think uh, these boys are that uh, merit of that uh, Prashant <laughs> Prashant is a as a director he's uh, I know very few people would know here but he's a national award winning filmmaker multiple national awards i think for his films and for him to pick a story like hanuman craft it the way it is and uh, i think we've see all of us have seen the promos and what it is and i don't think there's anybody better than this boy to play that in such a beautiful innocent manner and one is i'd like to congratulate the producers i think it's her it's people like you who push the boundaries and help filmmakers make these films so congratulations to you and all the very best Thank you. Hi everyone. Hi. Hi. Shadma this side from Home Bollywood. Prashant ji, मेरा सवाल आपसे है. So, Chiranjeevi sir ने announce किया that you know ticket her ticket पर का five rupees जो है वो आप राम मंदिर के लिए donate करने वाले हैं. मेरा सवाल ये है कि आपने कब और कैसे decide किया कि आपको ये करना है? And although ये film पहले release हो रही है, but अयोध्या में प्रमोशन के बारे में आपके क्या ख्याल हैं? और अयोध्या में प्रमोशन के लिए आई एन गेट यू सॉरी आई एन गेट द लास्ट पार्ट मतलब आप जाने वाले हैं आई यू इनवाइटेड फॉर द इनोग्रेशन सेरेमनी आई एम नॉट इनवाइटेड डेफिनेटली सी दिस इज हिज गिफ्ट टू अयोध्या या नाउ यू नो व्हाई ही इज हियर इनिशियली यू नो आई थिंक वी अनाउंस द रिलीज डेट लाइक सिक्स मंथ्स बैक बिकॉज फॉर अस जैन ट्वेल्थ इज संक्रांति सो संक्रांति इज लाइक अ बिग फेस्टिवल फॉर अस इन तेलुगु एंड एंड पीपल लव टू वॉच फिल्म इन दैट टाइम सो वी नेवर एक्सपेक्टेड जो अयोध्या में हो रहा है वो यू नो अराउंड दिस टाइम दैट इट विल हैपन बट वेन वी गॉट नो अबाउट इट वी इनिशियली थॉट विल नॉट इवन अनाउंस इट विल जस्ट डू इट on our own and then you know probably uh, talk about it but it was that in that moment when we told chiru sir i mean like chiranjeevi sir he felt so happy about it and he couldn't stop himself from saying it out loud so uh, and uh, i don't know if these people know about chiru leaks <laughs> so but yeah i think uh, we we will talk more about it post release of the film uh, than now yeah not now please so, prashant uh, to your right any any uh, teja uh, any compliments advice or tips received from uh, chiranjeevi sir always all whenever all his life huh all his life yeah all my <laughs> life uh, i've 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 grown up watching him uh, like in literal sense maine bachpan se chiru sir chiru sir se char film mein kaam kiya aur personally bhi unhone mai ek normal child artist hu koi background nahi hai mai 
they they've just seen me somewhere and they've casted me in a film that is the only relation i have with uh, chiranjeevi garu but he's always treated me like somebody from his own family so uh he's so humble i would i would like to tell you that all the discipline or hard work that if i if i'm doing something today that is because of chiranjeevi garu and if i'm standing here today that is because of chiranjeevi garu for sure wow. prashant to your right prashant yes hi akshay from ins i want to know that since you plan to release the film you know on a global scale uh, in a world wherein um, the audience is enamored by marvel and dc what is it about hanuman that will connect to a larger audience in your opinion exactly so uh, hanuman is uh, very rooted so it is our home ground superhero like you know uh, it, this story is basically inspired from uh, our indian ithasas our ithasas from our bharat but uh, if you look at the global step whatever you go more you have to go more local to become global so the go global audience you don't have to do a, a james bond kind of film here because they already have that so you don't have to do uh, you know some genres where you know they they already have all those genres so probably i think this uh, like how this reception of uh, uh, hanuman in north india is more than south india right now i think when the film gets released i think this i i strongly hope for and i think i really believe that you know this film will have lot of reception uh, in other countries like uh, look at rrr right so rrr is very rooted so it is very rooted and it is very uh, indian but uh, the international audience uh, you know they've loved the film so i think i will try to keep making films that are very rooted culturally rooted so that that will have uh, more audience now yeah so i think it, i mean like uh, uh, compared to marvel and dc i'm also a huge fan of marvel and dc but uh, this universe that i'm creating uh, that we are building together so has multiple superheroes so we are starting with hanuman but we've written couple of other superheroes there are like overlapping stories and all that but they are all inspired from our itihasas so uh, marvel and dc is more sci-fi but we are more fantasy and a little bit of sci-fi yeah i know uh rana lipika here how are you i'm well ma'am how are you baguna born in delhi so this is what happened she was trying to teach me hindi i taught her telugu and i went back yeah kaise ho ma'am yeah uh, fine thank you you know teja sajja when he entered uh, he said i don't have a robust six packs like you know you guys and yet he killed it would you like to say something about him oh, <laughs> he didn't listen to what i said if actually he didn't listen to what i said he wasn't here when i <laughs> so i'm asking his just, comment he's what's just your comment he's just trying to be humble he's got all of it going <laughs> and they're very true artists whatever the character requires if i'm sure if prashant asks of him to do anything and i'm sure he'll do it actually it was other way around like he was about when i said uh, we worked on already i think it's the third film we're working together uh when i said okay dude let's we are making a superhero film i didn't even tell him the story what the story is okay i just said we are making a superhero film i packed bags and started he started you know he he <laughs> went to gym you know he was working out and all that so one day I, you know it's been after couple of days i called him and he was like you know going to gym all the time so i told him dude you don't have to do all that so this is not that kind of superhero film so teja is very uh, professional and uh, very passionate actor so if the story needed to be bulked up story needed to have six packs and all that he would have definitely done it prashant even before the release as uh, this uh, uh, teaser has become so popular you know and someone from your team has already said that it's going to be very uh, i mean uh, it is going to get a good reception in hindi as equal into kg2 we've done that story also right. kgf right. would you like to elaborate on that uh i don't know about K comparison with kgf but yes uh i think it's mainly because of the title i think it's mainly because of uh, hanuman ji uh, even now today uh we uh, sankranti is a, like a big uh, festival for us and there are a lot of films coming there so everyone keeps telling me like you know this film will do more in north india than in telugu this film will do more uh, in uh, mumbai in, more in hindi than telugu so i don't know like you know probably uh, we have lot of stories and we have lot of filmmakers and i think the filmography of telugu cinema we've done more uh, uh, these kind of stories 
than any other industry. Uh, but I think the North Indians, uh, I mean, the North Indi I don't want to keep saying North India, South India, North Indian, South India, but we the Indian Indians. audience, yeah, Indian audience uh, love uh, and respect Hanumanji. And uh, he's the star of the film. And um, yeah, I mean, I think that answers your question. Yeah, on the f as you said, Sankranti, many films come up, you know. Maruti director is also launching Prabhas's film on the 14th, you know. I mean, tentative title, as uh, sources have been saying, it's Raja Sab, <laughs> though they de deny it. So on the 14th, yours is on the 12th, his is on the 14th. So the limelight will be distributed? Uh, Ma'am, actually, that's actually the, the film is not getting released. I think they are announcing. Yeah, the they announce. Yeah, but oh, we are I fine. Know the, I know the original title. He knows the original <laughs> title. Also. Oh, I was asking. <laughs> him. I'm not going to tell that. <laughs> we cannot I reveal was, that here. Yeah, I was asking him. He didn't tell me. But Indian audience, I mean, we uh, the Telugu audience or uh, audience are okay to consume more than one cinema. Like so, uh, I've, I'm the person who watches five films a day. So I think two films are like. The audience can definitely take it. Thank Rana, you. Rana, something Rana. about you? What are you doing in future? Though this is not a platform, but I'll you, come back you'll to you and be and going I'll be, back. I'll be the only guy standing here and be talking to you straight soon. Okay. Right. Hello. Okay. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, so, Sharik from Bazooka. So, my question is that I mean, I uh, have Thank you, Rana, for being here. Thank you so much. Sorry, yeah. sir. Sorry yeah. to interrupt you. Yeah, One no. second, I'll say bye. Rana, na. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot for being here tonight. It means a lot. I just have a flight to catch, otherwise I would have stayed here the rest. Sure. Sir, sorry. Uh, sir, my question is that, I mean, before this, there is a lot of regional, I mean, Mythological films or mythological characters. Ajay, shanti karte, please. Thank you. Ji. Mythological film or mythological, uh, my, uh, mythological characters ke upar film ban chuki hai. Aur log kafi sensitive hai. To is subjects ko leke aap log ne matlab ki kitna soch vichar kiya. Kyunki aap Northern India belt or especially Bollywood mein aap log uh, isko release kar rahe hai. To is cheez ka kitna khyal kiya ki language ke upar strong ho hona chahiye. Sir, sawal. Haan. Mere liye hai na sir, sawal. But. Director or producer, do okay. you want to talk? Uh, sir, like I said, I've uh, done my schooling in a Gurukul and uh, I was taught our Itihasas as a subject. So I, along with science, maths and all that, I was taught our Itihasas. So I've done extensive research. Uh, I know how sensitive uh, the stories that we are trying to tell. At the same time, we are not telling the story about Hanumanji. We are telling a, a current day story about a village lad, a very normal guy like you and me, an underdog who gets the powers of Hanumanji. But still, when we mention Hanumanji and when we uh, represent him in the film, I took utmost uh, care and I uh, you know, consulted uh, with some of the uh, scholars in this particular field and uh, I made sure I showed them all the sketches and I worked almost an year getting the character sketch right and almost two years to get the everything else right you know i hope you know i think you saw the trailer right yeah. i hope uh, you know I, I, i've represented him well thank you g thank you sir you wanted to ask something hi Hello everyone, this is Pavan from the Filmy Town. My question is for the director, Prashant yes, sir. sir. Welcome yes, sir. to the Mumbai. Thank uh, you, sir. What you can say, uh, as uh, we are hearing a lot of rumors about the budget, and a few bunch of people are saying 12 crores, few bunch of people saying 15 crores, 10 crores. What do you have to clear about this budget, and uh, what's the clarification? Uh, <laughs> see, <laughs> see, definitely uh, the budget that you mentioned is the budget that we started with. And uh, when we released the teaser, definitely that was the budget. But after the teaser, uh, you know, the expectations went sky high. Uh, at the same time, we discussed, the producer and all discussed. But at the same time, we cannot uh, make the budget 10 times more than what it is already. Because uh, that's what the expectation was. So people were comparing our film with 
uh, other films that are like 10 times, like 20 times more budget than us. So we definitely increased our budget a little, probably twice uh, the budget that we already had. But still, you know, it's we still made the film in that modest budget. Uh, but, you know, the amount of time that I've spent, you know, like we didn't work with big studios. Uh, so uh, we had spent more time in getting the work done by talented people uh, in small little companies. And, uh, you know, if I would have had, I mean, like if we would have had more budget, we could have done this in a much, you know, it took me almost like three years to make this film. I could have done it in one. But, uh, you know, to get everything right uh, with the limited budget, uh, definitely producer has uh, increased the budget uh, a little, but it is definitely not the kind of budget that you're thinking it'll be. <laughs> I cannot reveal that. Sir, you want to tell the budget of the film? Sir, you wanted to ask something. Yeah. You. Uh, we made with a modest budget, but uh, whatever the budget we spent on this project, Every penny will be seen on screen. Lovely. Yeah. <laughs> Hello. That's what every director wants to hear from his producer. <laughs> I'm glad he said that. Uh, Prashant sir. Uh, yeah, hi, Siddharth. Sir. Uh, first of all, I forgot to say the trailer looks so amazing. Thank you, sir. And Thank you so much. You've done a fantastic job so Thank far you. as the trailer. Uh, my question is, uh, keep uh, being a national award-winning director, um, how much the pressure was for you to b do this? Sir, uh, filmmaking is my passion, sir. So filmmaking is my hobby. So I uh, enjoy filmmaking in more than anything in my life. So even the first national award that I got is for VFX, for my first film. Uh, that had very uh, uh, limited number of shots uh, compared to what, uh, so almost like 100 times more, uh, uh, more number of VFX shots than my first film. Definitely no pressure. We or we were even after the huge reception of the teaser, uh, all the team were on like they were all like, uh, they were on high pressure like you know, uh, so they were all saying like sir you know there is so much reception you know, national wide, what are we gonna do about it? I said we'll keep doing what you we've been doing already, just because we got more hype, we will not less work on it. Just because we got uh, you know less hype, we will work more on it. We will keep doing what we have been doing already. And that's what uh, you know made it. Uh, you know that's what made us stand in front of you guys today. Thank uh, my you. question is All right. And um, uh, as you mentioned, um, in this uh, universe, you have more actors, and so yes, any 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 actor you have signed or anyone you can name for the further. Uh, there are a lot of uh, very interesting developments regarding the universe, but I think. Uh, it will all make sense. It will all have a value only after, only when this film works. If this film works, if this film really makes money, uh, so then we have a plan for next 10 years. So there are so many stories in our itihasas that are so exciting, so many characters. So Hanumanji is the most exciting character, most powerful superhero uh, and god uh, in our universe. But at the same time, there are a lot of, lot of, lot of stories that uh, current generation has to know. Like, I don't want to, I'm not matured enough or I'm not big enough director to direct those stories. So I thought, you know, I will make audience come to theater to uh, see a film that is set in current times, that is very modern. But when they leave theater, the kids will want to know more about our ithyasas, the ancient uh, stories. So that is what we are trying to do. And uh, I hope you will all support me in doing that. I mean, the best compliment that I received uh, for the teaser was uh, uh, an NRA guy uh, was telling me, like, you know, after uh, the, uh, he saw his kid saw the teaser, he wanted to know more about Hanuman. Like, who is Hanuman, Dad? Like, you know, I know I have Spider Man. You know, like he's wearing a Spider. My so the dad was so happy because, like, uh, you know, his kid was always asking for Spider Man bag, Superman something, and all that. But the, for the first time, when the dad uh, I heard his kid asking more about Hanuman. He said, I'm going to take my kid to your film so that, you know, I think, you know, all our, uh, all the parents will take their kids to uh, your film so that, you know, they will, you, you created that curiosity in them because you are uh, telling the story in a uh, template. Like, a you know, superhero template is the most coolest template right now. So they will 
get into the film uh, to see this uh, action superhero film but when they leave the theater they will uh, will pick that curiosity uh, in the kids to know more about our ancient scriptures teja uh, a superhero always has a costume uh, we always seen in uh, superhero yeah <laughs> so here we haven't seen you any so did you demand uh, Prash uh, prashant sir for the costume or something sort of sir it was a very conscious decision uh, taken by the taken by director of course that he wanted to bring out the indian outfits so th this is an indian outfit this is uh, this represents our indian culture so he wanted to he wanted to add this thing this is formed by kunkuma uh, do you say kunkuma in hindi also yes. kunkum uh, sorry kunkum yeah. sorry kunkum and pasupu pasupu ne wanta haldi 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 sorry 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 for this this is uh, kunkum and this is haldi so this is formed by this in the film so that is how a superhero costume is formed this is this will be the superhero costume for hanu man going forward also so i hope after watching this film uh, kids will kids will want to uh, wear these kind of costumes yeah. <laughs> i have a question for rivas that's all we have for you ladies and gentlemen uh, yes. ji I have a question for Rivas. Hi, I'm Akshay from INS. Uh, uh, you know, as the Indian cinema it gets more unified with the time, you know, the boundaries between different kind of cinemas across languages are getting getting diminished. Uh, what does the road ahead look for RKT Studios? Uh, we'll. Uh, I think uh, personally, what I feel that uh, with collaborations like these, uh, moving forward, I think Telugu industry, a Bharat ke kaisi industry hai, which I feel is capable. of making these kind of projects uh, yeah, but telugu ek aisi industry hai jahan pe humne dekha hai ki is uh, it's difficult to make these films aur jaise prashant ne bola he is uh, his schooling has happened in gurukul so i really feel that uh, like we saw rrr we saw bahubali so the telugu industry has a lot of these young directors a lot of directors who are capable of handling such projects so of course we continue associating ourselves with the south indian film industry the way we are doing it and the road ahead looks good it looks good for i think bharat ke cinema ke liye the road is looking good when we have capable directors like prashant who are capable of showcasing such films on the big screen thank you so much rabas for sharing that before we wrap up just one last thing teja if you or prashant sir you'd like to tell us you know talking about the entertainment quotient of course hanuman ji has always you know inspired of course all of us at the same time wo ek bade you know bachchon ke liye bhi he's been there yeah. unke liye bhi wo he's someone that uh, kids look up to wo entertainment quotient ki agar main baat karu so who are we targeting here will target for kids from 3 years old yeah to people aged at 80 years old that's the target audience for us uh, this film has a uh, lot of fun also right this has uh, superhero fights huh. this has uh, kids pleasing fights yeah uh, this has uh, the itihasas god element to it you will have goosebumps in the film watching the film couple of times for sure right uh, you'll have great music and you'll have uh, great fun watching this film this will be a proper entertainer for you wow he said it yeah to add to what uh, uh, teja has already said uh, this film uh, is not like dc serious film okay huh. so huh. this is very uh, fun film you know, when you think of hanuman what all you think so you, he has a lot of uh, qualities right so this film will have all those qualities so uh, hanuman is quirky hanuman uh, is play, uh, playful you know hanuman is strong yes. hanuman fights back so whatever the qualities you like about hanuman uh, hanuman ji uh, all these uh, qualities will be there in our film yes so uh, the for the kids there will be a lot of uh, you know superhero stuff uh, for the youth there's a lot of, uh, of fun and all that there is action there is strong emotion so one thing that i can tell about this film is uh, you know we've done a lot of vfx and everything we had a couple of test screenings for the film and i thought you know if once they come out of the theater everybody will be praising me for the vfx that we have done okay i was just waiting for you know like tell me how cool my vfx are so then everybody was so emotional and they said this is so emotionally strong film and i was uh, pleasantly uh, surprised but i was very very happy uh, when uh, they said they uh, they are taking the film with them because it has struck the emotional chord almost 100 out of 100 people said 
the best part of this film is the emotion with a very strong emotion so and i'll also tell the main theme of the film uh, so why this film is made and what is the thing that they take away uh, that, uh, from the uh, film so the film is about uh, dharma okay when you stand i mean like i think the trailer also says it out loud so there is a character in the film there's a point in the film when the main lead uh, will become uh, one you know like i mean like he's just uh, he's he's just one person without any support like you know there is a, an army there is a there is a very huge uh, uh, army against him but he's just this one person so he'll say like how can this one person can fight that army so then that particular character that comes in the film uh, the uh, the character that is saying those dialogues so he will come and say anybody anybody who stands up for the dharma anybody who fights for the dharma hanuman ji will be always there so you are never alone anyone uh, for righteousness for dharma so if you don't be worried that you know when there is something wrong going so don't be worried that you know i cannot stop this because like i'm only one person i'm alone i cannot fight this war so don't worry about it you just let's go fight for it yeah. i think hanuman ji is always there you know he is just that one hanuman ji is enough to fight an entire army yeah, yeah. so that's what this film teaches uh, the audience absolutely one man can hanuman can by the grace of and blessings of hanuman ji thank you so much for being here हमसे यहाँ पे आके इतनी सारी बातचीत करने के लिए एंड रिस्पॉन्स तो जैसा मैंने कहा आपने देख ही लिया तेजा यूड लाइक टू से समथिंग थैंक यू सर थैंक यू एवरीबॉडी फॉर बीइंग हियर दिस इज माय फर्स्ट टाइम इन मुंबई यू आर ऑल वेरी वेरी स्वीट फर्स्ट टाइम इन मुंबई एज एन फॉर अ प्रेस कॉन्फ्रेंस यू आर ऑल वेरी वेरी स्वीट टू अस थैंक यू आई होप यू शावर यूर लव इन द सेम वे थैंक यू थैंक यू एंड आई रैप अप से वन लास्ट थिंग अबाउट द फिल्म Uh, the film will not have feature one single uh, smoking scene or one single drinking shot so the film is so clean uh, the film will not even have a disclaimer in the beginning the film uh, i don't know I, i think it's been a very long time i went to watch the film with my parents and i think it's uh, it's, it's been a really long time a lot of your people uh, to uh, uh, you know to go uh, to watch the film with lot of uh, you know the entire family because there is always we are little worried that there will be something in the film that will you know make us feel little uncomfortable to watch with your family and hanuman is that film that you can blindly go with your entire friends and family and watch it without because like even for the sensor we received sensor without any cuts they said this is very clean this is so clean and this is that film i don't know when was the last time you went to watch that film with your entire family friends and everything trust me this is that film go and watch it on jan 12th and uh, i'm sure that you will really really like it thank you prashant sir thank you so much for sharing all of that teja sir thank you so much and yes uh, we'll have a quick photo up with the director and the actor uh jai shri ram and jai bachrang bali jai hanuman <laughs>